What up, 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 world? It's your boy Amp Dog with another episode of Politicking. Want to thank everybody for tuning in, showing your love, and uh, make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend. Big Amp Dog said, What's the deal? And today we're going to talk about a, a Victorville, a California deputy, a sheriff's deputy named Corey Smith. Um, is on administrative leave after kicking the man in the head while he was on the ground. Uh, this happened on the morning, well, early morning of June 16th, 2021. Uh, the victim's name is Willie Jones of Victorville, California. Um, basically, the police was, I guess, pursuing him in some type of pursuit because he was speeding on a motorcycle. Um they said that basically he disregarded a bunch of traffic signals, blowing right past him, leading the chase, um, <clears throat> leading to a chase. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> would make it would make it even more dangerous. Of course, this is what they're saying. This is all coming from the the sheriff's the, the sheriff's office. Um, it's it's yeah. He was he was riding you know at high speeds. You know, um, after he got off, uh, he basically dropped off his motorcycle near uh near a uh, dealership and then he foot he fled on foot uh you know the police always set up a perimeter so they set up a perimeter and then um basically i'm gonna show y'all the video too of the excessive force um video of the officer and what he did to this guy but um <clears throat> i don't know let's just get to the video let me just get to the video first let me just get to the video Let's get there first, and then we can uh, we can do the rest. Hold on, let me make sure it's queued up though. All right, let's see. All right, so y'all just watch this video real quick, and then. We're going to go back in on what's going on. So this is the parking lot. This is where he's basically, um, you seen him with his hands up, and then you see the officer, uh, like, lunchroom, uh, handball, you know what I'm saying, dodgeball, soccer, football. Um, he, he, yeah, look at, it, look at it in close slow motion or close up. And I, I, part of me feel like, part of me feel like, um, this young man, uh, Willie Jones, was knocked out after that first hit. Uh, part of me feel that way. Um, and this is the the dude right here. Sorry if the picture's a little, little blurry, distorted, but I couldn't find nothing else. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, um, like I always say, a lot of these bad cops, they do. They fit the description as, you know, somebody that was getting bullied or punked in school. You know what I'm saying? Realistically, I'm sure Corey Smith, you know, he he when he got that badge, it was like a, a newfound like manhood. You feel me? So uh, he's on paid administrative leave right now, too. So that's the real reason why I really want to talk about it. Yeah. <clears throat> I think the police need to stop uh, thinking that they could just go ahead and take things into their own hands as far as uh, who they thinking that they who they think that they are as far as the authority. And that's why you're starting to see a lot of officers across this country starting to get dome shots or getting ambushed is because people like this guy. Um, <clears throat> and I'm certain it's just like with anything. Sometimes the cops that are getting the bad stuff done to them are probably really that small select few that are good officers you know what i'm saying but um yeah i guess in the effort to maintain transparency uh the supervisor arrived on scene and once they realized his his uh arrest was captured on surveillance cameras from a nearby business um they basically had immediate concern of the deputy's actions uh, so he basically put an investigation out on the off. I mean, yeah, on the deputy uh, and his conduct. Uh, Willie Jones was arrested. You know what I'm saying? He was provided medical care. Uh, right now, I think he just, you know, pretty much waiting on his his uh, his chance to sue. Because, yeah, if you break the law, there are consequences. But uh, 
that type of uh, response and actions from a law enforcement uh, officer who's supposed to, you know, protect and serve. Um, that's that's just not called for. It's not it's not it's not a good look um, by any any means, you know, so I definitely want to. Um, you know, uh, big up Willie Jones for, you know, being able to ma maintain his composure. I seen him in an interview and he doing what he's supposed to get paid, young nigga, get paid. You know, as for this officer, I would like to see him fire, maybe even face some, you know, some assault charges. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, clearly, um, I don't know why, but it seems like this officer had some type of personal vendetta and what we could all probably agree on is that maybe they did have a run-in before maybe they didn't but um it should be definitely a uh, cause to you know look further into maybe this was some type of targeted hate crime you know what i'm saying i don't know y'all y'all drop your comments down below like share hit that notification bell and where it go low ring so that every time i upload y'all catch it um tell a friend to tell a friend big amp dog said what's the deal and as always protect yourself protect your people peace